I'm going to try and talk over this. Um, here you can see the settings of the SMC utility. I haven't been game to turn it up more than uh, 221 on the pulse width modulation. We've got the um, two power supplies working in parallel, uh, linked together by a 12 gauge, 12 gauge strap. Uh, they each go to these 100 amp diodes. The diodes join together at the junction of this uh, 60 amp diode. That then goes to the Sabertooth 2x60. Also joining it are two 12 volt batteries, 33 amp hours. The negative comes up here, goes through this switch. That then goes to the negative of the Sabertooth. The output of the Sabertooth, at least uh, motor one, goes through a relay and the relay together with the positive it's the negative of the the relays the negative of the motor goes to this 400, 450 watt uh, motion dynamics motor DC motor 24 volts got a Vichy pot, 10 turn pot, being driven by the uh, toothed gear and a 3D printed um, rod, rod holder driving the carbon fiber. There's a couple of um, limit switches those limit switches are to this self-latching relay. That's basically the start switch. So that when one of these uh, limit switches, <coughs> excuse me, one of these limit switches are hit, it drops the relay out. So this relay now is um, unpowered and the circuit won't start again until I push the um, self-latching button. Actually moves faster in real life than the camera can show.